Hello everybody, it's Connor and Pete. Yes, Pete's here. Happy Sunday, I said it Yes, me. happy Sunday. You beat me to it this week. Oh well, we still said it. Anyway, this is CGN uh, for the 23rd of November. You'll be probably glad to hear that the game releases have started to ease off a bit now that we're coming to the end of 2014. And um, yeah, we've managed to get Tuesday down from four pages to just one. So... Here we go. Tuesday the 25th of November, we've got Geometry Wars 3 Dimensions coming out on the PS4, PS Vita and PC. We've got Penguins of Madagascar coming out on the Wii U and 3DS. Movie license game there for you. Penguins. What, sorry? Do you, do you know what Penguins of Madagascar is? Yes, it's the yeah. Penguins from Madagascar. Um, <laughs> Perso uh, Persona, Persona Q, Shadow of the Lady Rinth. Uh, lay, lady Rymph Labyrinth. Lay, labyrinth. Labyrinth. Oh, okay. I was going to say Lady Rymph then. <laughs> <laughs> There's me and my mispronunciation of words again. That's coming out on the 3DS on uh, when Wednesday. Sorry, the 26th of November. We've got Geometry Wars 3 Dimensions on the Xbox One. That should say Xbox One, not PC. Excuse my rubbishness. Editing this. On Thursday, the 27th of November, we've got Raven's Cry. Don't think that's got anything to do with the CBBC show Raven. Oh, really? But that's coming out on PC, Mac, and Linux. You, you know can have they, a look if have you they want. Have made a game for Raven on the CBBC? Probably though. not. Oh, I wish they would. That's I pretty, can't that's imagine. I can't imagine that that would work out too well. But uh, I don't know. I suppose it would. I don't know. Friday the twenty eighth, we've got Emergency Five coming out on the PC, and um, that's it. That's it for the uh, game releases this week. Got a bit of news though for you, which um, Pete is happily going to read out in a moment. Or now, rather. Hey everyone, it's me, and I'm reading the news today, as always. Except from when I'm away. Um, yeah, it's Xbox One's first birthday. Because it was November, I think it was to the day, isn't it? What? Is it, is it to the day when it came out? No, 22nd. 22nd, oh, never mind. Uh, it's Probably Xbox you've One's. Been sat here a year, Xbox it's Xbox One. One's 366th yes, day birthday. Amazing. Why are you. Don't know, I've turned it on. Some cool Xbox One sound effects there in the background. Uh, yeah, yesterday, which was the 22nd, um, marked the first anniversary of the launch of the Xbox One. And Microsoft did something lovely to celebrate it. Uh, to mark the occasion, they allowed all Xbox Live Gold members to play the full version of the newly released Sunset Overdrive for 24 hours. Uh, during this, well, during this time, players were able to access everything in the game, including the entire story and the multiplayer. They could unlock achievements and save their progress if they decided to purchase the game later on. Uh, so it was Microsoft's way of saying thank you for the last year, and the Xbox One and its gamers are set to keep on improving in the years to come. Lovely. That's kind yes. Of, very kind of them. Very kind gesture. Can't believe it's been out a year already. I can't I believe it. Really cannot. It's flown. I know. Literally. Moving on. Um, Certainly with this game Trials, it has. Trials Fusion is finally going to be getting a multiplayer at last. I'm very relieved about this because I've been waiting forever. Ubisoft recently confirmed that the new Trial, well not really new anymore, that Trials Fusion will be getting an online multiplayer mode. Uh, which is due to come out in early 2015 as part of an update I think. Um, is it, yeah it's free isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Uh, an exact date um, has not been confirmed yet. It will probably be before the game's first birthday in April though. Currently, That's what we're predicting. Okay. Or I'm predicting. That's what you're predicting, right? Yes. Uh, currently, there is a multiplayer beta available on the PC version to um, to test some of the upcoming features in multiplayer mode. Which, to and be honest with you, isn't much different than Trials Evolution, it seems. Exactly. Is there any like is there a new mode? I or anything? think there's a new mode, but I'm not 100% sure. There'll probably be something like FMX mode or something where you got to score oh, the most the God, most points or something. Surprise me. <laughs> Uh, a new update was recently released, which has added an, was added new teams feature, whereby players can join or create teams with up to 50 members, so pretty much like a clan in a way. Yes. And uh, team members must battle rivals to work their way up in the leaderboard to boost their team score, which yes. sounds jolly exciting. So go and do that. Yeah, we'll have to make a team, Pete. What should we call our team? I don't know. The Synergy team, that'll do. I think reviewing it though, we'd be near the top of the rankings. <laughs> Uh, nominees announced for the 2014 Game Award. How lovely. Well, Game Awards 2014, as I wrote it. Oh, yeah, that, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, um, yeah, they've been announced last week uh, with a lot of great games being up for the nominations. Uh, the games um, up for the Game of the Year are Bayonet 2, Dark Souls 2, Dragon Age Inquisition. Is that Inquisition? Yes. Yeah. Uh, sorry, I haven't played that before. I do apologise. Um, Hearthstone. I... I, I... 
I guess it's Hearthstone. And Middle Earth Shadow or of Stone. And Middle Earth Shadow of Mordor, which is the only game I've played. Sorry, viewers, I've, I, that's the only game I've played out of all of them. Um, but there are a lot of categories um, with lots of other games being nominated for them. Uh, the awards are going to take place on the 5th of December in Las Vegas, and members of the public can tune in um, on various platforms, including Xbox Live, PSN, and YouTube. Yeah, there's there's quite a lot of categories. There's like races, there's sort of like best narrative, oh, okay. best storyline. So it's kind of like the Oscars. So, but... it, kind of, but for video games. I'm not sure if this is like an official Game Awards thing. Like, it's sort of... Like uh, sort of like the Oscars, which is an official awards mm. ceremony, isn't it? Yeah. Whereas this, I'm not sure if it's official or not. They need to make a gaming Oscars. I think that'd be quite cool. This might be it. I don't know. I haven't really I'll researched just, into it that much. I'll see how big it gets then. Um, that's it for the news and stuff this week. So um, hope you enjoyed this video. Do just like it and subscribe. Do that. Yep. And we'll see you next week for lots of lovely more, lots of more lovely news. Bye bye.